they heard like a low moaning sound. It was around five o'clock Saturday night. And then we heard something that definitely sounded like knocking. Somebody yelling, help help me and screaming and we couldn't figure out where it was coming from. Zachary Hahn and several other men who live in a recovery house in Cam's Corners decided to search the school next door. Once we were looking for the sound, we ended up at a brick wall and we could hear it next to a, a boiler room. An adult male had tried to enter the school through the top of a chimney. He'd gotten about 20 feet down. Cleveland Fire's technical rescue team responded to a call of an entrapment at St. Patrick's School on Puritus Avenue. They had a pulley system set up that they were trying to pull him up from the top of the chimney. They weren't able to get a, a, a line underneath him. So firefighters decided to breach the chimney from below, removing the bricks one by one until they were able to pull him out. They had a, a situation where they set up that was providing fresh oxygen, you know, fresh air into the in the environment to make sure that he was protected as best he could. And then they were they just took their time in removing the bricks, but we were still there. We were less, I think it was less than an hour to get him out. Now the man was taken to an area hospital in stable condition. Firefighters say he was a bit cramped from being stuck in the chimney for almost an hour. However, he was able to avoid any other major injuries. And I was actually looking down uh, the space at where this guy was and how a human body even got in there uh, it was shocking to me. Firefighters say the man is lucky to be alive. However, it's still unclear as to why he was trying to get into the school through the chimney in the first place. To disassemble the bottom of the chimney in that amount of time, I thought they did a really nice job. Not what we expected the where to find him. In Cleveland, Melissa Reed, Fox 8 News.